The A-10 is the first Air Force aircraft to be developed specifically for the close air support role in a combat zone. It can loiter in a combat area for almost two hours and still return to a base 250 miles away. The A-10 can operate on 2,000-foot runways close to the battle area to improve its response to combat conditions. It's also designed for rapid turnaround between missions and sustained operations over a long period of time. Its cruising speed is 340 miles per hour for low altitude and low airspeed operations, where faster aircraft are less effective. This twin-engine single-seat aircraft can carry up to eight tons of mixed ordnance, including conventional bombs, rockets, and air-to-surface missiles. Its unique armament, however, is the 30-millimeter Gatling gun, which can fire 2,000 or 4,000 rounds per minute. This gun can defeat heavily armored tanks in a single strafing pass. For survivability, the A-10 combines a backup flight control system and self-sealing fuel tanks with protective armor enclosing the cockpit area. The armor protects the pilot from both high explosives and 23 millimeter armor piercing projectiles. The A-10 has advanced avionics, including a head-up display unit, which couples a visual presentation of both combat and flight information with target identification and fire control equipment. The Tactical Air Command received the first A-10 in March of 1976, and eventually over 700 aircraft will be in service.